Mary. Eddie, present for you. What? Oh, Eddie. Ah, grand. Uh, and paper. Oh, no need to paint with shit. No need to smear on walls. Oh, oh. Now go on, monster. Draw. Hugo, are you shopping? Shopping? No, why? Because it's your turn. There's no food in the house. The only thing in the kitchen is a cluster of thirty dirty milk bottles, and while you're out, you might return them. Thursday. Zimmerman's turn. Oh, I don't know where he is. I think he's gone. Gone? Why? Dunno. Perhaps we disagreed with him. Can't you? Oh, all right. The temptations of Christ. The devil comes on horrible, because God made him come bad. But now the temple, gold. The mountain, every color. Christ, the silver, fool. I'll hang it up. Brenda, what is this? I don't know. It's a group of artists. They want to stage an event. Brenda, I'm a bit concerned. Hmm? That we're being kind of taken over. Well, by freaks, and you know, freaks. I mean, uh, event. We shall stop, show stop this of people. It's very hard to follow. It's erratically punctuated. I'm not 100% convinced, in fact, that it means anything at all. Disintegration. Devil's clawing bits of people he has broken, but he can't engulf them to St. Michael Spears' heart. I'll nail it up. Ah, Hugo, did you know that people's bodies in America are so eradicated that it's illegal to transport mother's milk across state lines? Except, of course, in the original containers. No, I didn't know that. God's mother, for the world, bordered in gold, the breasts are revealed. They succor men. I'll put it in the games room. Lawrence? Yes. My chair. It is. My things. They are. Lawrence, get off my chair. Give me a reason. No. Then no. What a shit heap. Yes, Lawrence. Mayor, Mary, you must, you must tidy up. All oh, these things. Yes, Mary, you must move your things. Don't. What? Don't boss me. Other people keep things in the room. Don't tell me what to do. Now oh, come on, Mary Love. Let's get this. Do what Eddie says. Yes, Eddie. I have just been to a committee meeting of an organization of radical therapists entitled Shrinks of Socialism. They are planning a conference on the gestalt road to revolution that will form, I gather, the first step in a plan to take over the world on strict Marxist Jungian lines in the land of the mind. The slogan runs, the one id man is king. Sadly, we didn't get that far. We were only, in fact, on matters arising when the treasurer accused the chairman of a conscious strategy of maternal double bind on thereupon freaked out. She's very strongly strong. She's highly strong. I was informed. She should be. I replied. Hey, Beth, why not just lie down and do the first thing that comes into my head? Well, then I'll just go and... Eddie. Hello, Mary. How's your day? Eddie, please tell them. Tell them what? About the games room. Oh, the games room. Now? Yes, now. Well... Uh, well, Mary wants to paint the games room. If that meets with in the games room, more like on its, on its, on it. It's wall. Uh, a kind of mural painting on the wall. Last week, I remember she did just that with chalk all over. Walls and chairs, the billiard table, crisscross spiders web all over. Quite a mess. She cleaned it up. You cleaned it up. Connections. Everyone connected to each other. What? That's what she meant. There is an awful lot of money, Mary Barnes, around this house. It is, in fact, quite difficult avoiding it. Right, bread and wine, I shall at least make supper. My mother said, don't paint outside the lines. I sploshed about, I shouldn't paint outside the lines. My mother was a spider. You are like a mother to me, Brenda. A story. Backward. Of a Glasgow bug house. Jockey lies there, screaming. Get away, you buggers, get away. To quieten him. Quiet in him. The surgeon decides to perform a transorbital lobotomy, and it's a great success, for after it, old jockey is heard screaming, Can I hear the buggers? Can I can I hear the buggers now no more? Well that's more most affecting. Anyone here in favor of transorbital lobotomy? Another story. Woman had a phobia about group therapy, for which she'd been prescribed. The day it came she tried to run away. They rug rugby tackled her, 
injected tranquilizer, dragged her to the room, and if they hadn't, so the doctor said, she would have missed her therapy. That's very salutary. wonder if there's anybody here would want to do that kind of thing. It isn't mad to want to paint on walls. Leonardo painted things on walls. Oh, Jesus. You mustn't talk to yourself, Dougie. You'll get locked up in mental hospital. Anyone? Some wine? Mary, love, eat. You don't eat up. You won't get your dessert. Leave her alone. Well, should she? Lawrence eats all of his. Well, Lawrence isn't. It's good for you. The greens. All right. Shall we stop pretending? Yes, let's stop pretending. Stop pretending what? Well, for a start, let's drop this crap about no rules. Go on. I will. Rule one, there are no rules. Rule two, it is against the rules to question rule one. Rule three, it, ex it is against the rules to acknowledge the existence of rules one and two. What are you suggesting, Doggy? I'm suggesting that we are pretending not to have rules, and we should admit that we have rules, and people who break them persistently should leave the community. I am suggesting that we are pretending not to be doctors, and we are doctors, and we can in the context of a non-coercive environment. Without drugs or shock, admit to so being. I am suggesting that the community is falling apart because of its childlike faith that if you scatter six seed on the ground and neither prune nor tend nor water it, then that by a process of immaculate dissemination will mend and heal and grow. What are you suggesting? A medical director of the community rules on admittance and dismissal from the community, regular compulsory meetings of the community to discuss. When you say dismissal, did you have anyone in mind? You said it. 